most of nobody has ever seen. Uh, you're going to hear a lot about him. Tombstone Tony Redman. Uh, our next entertainer has spent a long time looking into the history and everything about Richard Boone. And uh, Dick Schilling is going to come out right now, and he's going to do his persona of Richard Boone as Paladin. back to time. September 14, 1957, Saturday evening, 9.30, CBS, something was about to happen. There's a name in the books for a man like you, a pallet. Yeah, a paladin. That's a gentleman knight in shiny armor, all armed with a cause and righteousness and a fine pointed lance and yet a mercenary. A man that hires out for gold. What was your prize, my paladin? How much gold did they pay you to slay the dragon? There was but one ballad, and his name was Richard Boone. He brought Paladin into life, and the words of Johnny Western made him immortal. He was the last knight. His lance for battle was a handcrafted 45. His coat of arms was a chestnut of silver. And this was his call to adventure. In light of what has happened to this nation, 
It is now past time for each one of us to become a paladin. The last verse of the Star Spangled Banner is a question. Does that Star Spangled Banner still wave for the land of the free and the home of the brave? From that fiery hell of 9-11, when the towers went down, Flight 93 went into Shanksville, Pennsylvania. The answer rang crystal clear across this land. You damn right it does. For freedom is not free. It never was. Amen. May the chest knight on your holster never tarnish. Thank you. May God bless America.